for he sold me from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue up. Because... Well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall. A consequence of her service to the NUS and President Myers. I'm not about to pretend I understand the tech wise and hows. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, Killer. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. So this neural matrix, how much do we know? Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint U.S. Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter Arasaka Soul Killer. The Matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the Black Wall, and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you and Songbird. All right. Plan. Let me hear it. Hanson to meet with the Netrunners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close to Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know it's security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hansen access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hansen's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural Matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now we just need to take those twins out of the equation. Emmerich and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand? Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. Yeah, I buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, cause they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hansen. So we kidnap them. How we wanna do this? They're driving a rental while in NT, an exploitable opening. We're gonna track their ride and hijack it before they reach Hansen at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Addicts will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavior imprints are tuned already. And you're rolling all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your exfil route. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem-free. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hansen. Right. Where you'll sell him the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Gonna disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Hansen and his goons. Aim to handle them on your own? Can do a lot more than play dress-up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. Sounds like Flatline and Hansen set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at this stage. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the NUS. And Songbird? We have to rescue her. Myers told you as much yourself. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. How much have you told Myers? What's she know? That Somi's fallen into the hands of the man who's organized the downing of Space Force One. Is that all? All for now. Main goal. I want to make sure I'm clear. We're springing Songbird free from Hansen's iron grip and seizing tech that's going to save your lives. You and Alex enter the stadium as Hansen's visiting Netrunners. Disguise is our key to the op. First step, what was it again? Securing a trace on the Netrunner's car. This bit's on you. Alex will expand on that in a minute. Meanwhile, we'll make sure the personality data and imprints are airtight. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. So, time we talk nabbing the runners? 
Cover that in a minute. You know Reed better than I do. What he thinks. What's his true aim here? Save him so me or carrying out a mission? Saul imagines he's responsible for her. Always has. Thinks he's responsible for all of us. Hell, even for you, I bet. It's how he keeps his grip on reality. Life. With mixed results, mind you. Hmm. And so me? Same story as always. Dares, lands neck deep in shit, somehow crawls out. Rinse and repeat. Myers doesn't know the deeds of this op, does she? Never will, is that right? It's not wrong. So we serve Hanson up on a silver platter, and be salutes and handshakes. Shit goes sideways, we're royally fucked. Welcome to the agency. And any for your thoughts, Alex, about all this? Honestly, still wondering why neither of us went back to DC. Not me, not Reed. They put him to sleep, saddle you with a Dogtown assignment. Who are you kidding? Say we disobeyed orders, gone back. A dressing down by some bureaucrat would be the worst we'd have had to endure. Think... Think we were both waiting for something, like the downing of Space Force One. Probably makes us a sad fucking pair of hypocrites. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far. Near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. The stations. How do they work exactly? They ping vehicle IDs across the network. Monitor location, tire pressure, all of that. Hack them, and it'll be open season on the runners. Find it hard to believe taking one station will be enough. Rental agencies got rare rides to protect. Hmm. See if I can find more info. If the one's not enough, we'll improvise. So, breach the station, trace a car. Good. What then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Dunno. Anything goes wrong, I'll be stuck in there. Suck it up. This is FIA Trunk Ops, soldier. <laughs> Seriously, though, the tech just works. And we'll have your back the whole way. You know, Kabuki's tech wizards sell similar stuff under the counter. Wouldn't ever call it reliable. Well, fed tech wizards are just more skilled than kabukis. Better be. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it.
a sweet ride around these parts. How about you bring her over? I already know how it's done. Now just 
just lose the company. Порядок восстановлен. Всем нарядом вернуться к патрулированию. between us. It's gotta. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk for you. Okay, aid to Delta. We'll see you soon.
А, плохо дело. Well, This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. Means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. Swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it, every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn, actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it, Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape, just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasted funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scop dogs around. He's shit-talking one of his tunes. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Know how you feel. Wasn't anything like Brooklyn, my home, but... Got a memory you cherish? It never gets peaceful where I'm from. Just know that wherever I am in the world, it feels like I'm walking Haywood streets. Yearning to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you miss something, it's usually too late. <sighs> Suppose we should get back to the here and now. Songbird, need you to be straight with me. I... I helped Hanson spring the trap on Myers. My end of the deal, in exchange for the neural matrix. I down the plane, deliver Myers, yes. But blast her out of the sky, then hunt her down? Wasn't what we agreed. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself too, almost. Ground the plane. That was the plan. Didn't expect he'd... blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix, and for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. I fucked everything up, I know, V. But I had no choice. Always got a choice, Song. Always. Did it. Not this time. For 
from Myers, the NUSA. Um, just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. And weapons and tools, they don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Burden of past mistakes. We both bear it. It ain't easy. Me for the biochip, you for the black wall. You mean to say it's my fault? No, just that when you try to save yourself, it's usually somebody else who pays the price. Hmm. Yeah. Ain't that the brutal fucking truth? You're the only one I could trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, feel the same way about me. I want to ask, actually, what happened exactly? You know, when you reached past the Black Wall. Know the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life, but it just turns up blank. Mean losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes I, I lose control or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else. But it feels horrible. I felt it too, with the Chimera. Like a living nightmare. Yeah. More and more, I get the sense someone's standing behind me. But there's never anyone there. Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. Trust Reed? Guy wants to save your life. Mm-hmm. He saved me once already. Word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk, so he knocked on a 19-year-old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse. Uh, join his serve or become a Netwatch trophy. That girl died that day. The person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed... He died too. Just more recently. Seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence. Yet he serves the country to this day. Clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. <laughs>